first guest found fame at the age of 30 when she starred in her own TV series, Lizzie McGuire. Since then, her career has really taken off. She starred in Hollywood movies and has become a multi-platinum recording artist. Next month, she's due to release her fourth solo album. It's called Dignity, and look at this. Please welcome the fantastic Hilary Duff. Like, I know what that's like a little bit. That we're all <laughs> monstrously jealous of you. You're 19 years old. You've got yeah. a fantastic acting career, a singing career. You've got your own clothing range and perfume. What else is there to do? You've done it all. Oh my gosh, I don't know. I, I haven't, I haven't gone to do everything that I want to do. You know, what's within left? all those things. What's left? What are you going to do? Oh my. Well, I mean, there's different More. movie roles <laughs> yeah, and movie you know, roles different kinds of do. records and. This do, album. Tell us about this mean? album, Dignity. Oh, this record was so, so much fun, and, and before I never really wrote my music, and um, I mean, I got to work with great people that gave me material that kind of like related to my life at the time, and, mm -hmm. and so I, I related to it, but I wrote this record, and yeah. that's such a, such a great feeling just to be really honest and be yourself and, and let people kind of know what's... Is it really beat. personal? Are the songs sort it's of related really... to your own experiences yeah and it's scary so it's quite revealing then isn't it it is you're kind of like oh do i want this there's one we've read about me? today in our papers i don't know if you've seen it yet you've written a song about um supposed to be about nicole mm. richie and your ex Jill. i know you know what? i got an email on my blackberry about that is that not true is that not true it's not true i wrote oh. i wrote all the songs you know before i even knew i was in bulgaria filming a movie and so i found out that my ex-boyfriend was <laughs> had a new girlfriend really really soon after we broke up um like Rat. two weeks after they had already been like out and oh. doing this so I was like out of the loop so you, you should have done a whole album on it and really given them stupid. no no and the songs aren't about about that there's a song on it called dignity that's that's or it's called where's your dignity and it's about just kind of living in LA and how so many people there Mm. don't really care to have it, have yeah. dignity, mm. and, and, and they just treat people with no regard. And, you know, if you have the hottest handbag, you're like it's the really, coolest news, and mm. it's there's a war going on, you, you know. You are huge there, and yet you haven't gone off the rails. Why have other people your age who've done what you've done, why haven't they, you know, we're talking about Britney, we're talking about you know, some of the other girls out there. You're, you seem very grounded. I think a lot of it has to do with my family. You know, I'm really close with my family, and... Um, I've been traveling for such a long time, you know, on the road and, and working and stuff, and everyone's just, people don't give me whatever I want whenever I want it, yeah. you know, and, and, and people tell me no, and, yeah. you know, um... Oh, I'd fire them. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> You're too busy to go off the rails, aren't you? I mean, you've been making films, you've just got a new film out with your, your, and your, with your sister. sister. Yeah. Yeah. How was that? How was working with your sister? So much Great. fun. We live together, so, I mean, we're best friends, and, and it's tough to travel so much and not get to spend as much time with her as I would like, and, um... So make, getting to drive to work together every day and just be on set, and we actually, we showed up on set the first day and they had two trailers, and we were like, We'll share. It's okay. Because we just <laughs> hung out. You know, it was like one was going to waste, so. So there's no sibling rivalry as such with you and your sister? No. I mean, did you get the scripts and go, your part's bigger than mine? I know. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? That's funny. Her part's actually bigger than mine in the movie. But it's, yeah, I mean, we don't really care about that kind of... Really, honestly, I know that it seems like, you know, it, it wouldn't be true. Yeah. But there's not rivalry. Like, we're 100% supportive of each other. And so we fight. Like, like mm. she can leave shoes all over the house and she's very very messy and i'm kind of a freak who was saying that they like don't like their stuff to be messed with when their husband yeah. comes home no. you know, oh, sure. i don't like my stuff messed with no, 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 no. I don't like that either. And then you're like, yeah. no, 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 and no. And they drop Wait. their things near yours and it all gets confused. <laughs> the the film is based on two um, highly social young girls who've yeah. got no interest in the family business. Is that based on anyone that we know, do you think? 
<laughs> Maybe. Maybe. I think we can guess. Um, you, used to, you used to be blonde, didn't you? I did. And now you're brunette. Yeah. So we've what do you think? Picture, haven't we? Oh, oh, yeah. oh look, oh. you suit that. Wow. They do, but you suit dark as well. I you think do you're actually. Dark hair. Thank you. What do, do you think? Blondes have more fun or more striking, or what do you think? You know what? I don't know if they have more fun. I feel not as bubbly when I'm brunette. Yeah. Which maybe more serious. Yeah. So other people are probably like, what? Because I'm always like, no, 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 you know, like really hyper yeah. and really bubbly. And but I feel like also that I have to wear more makeup now that I'm a brunette. Right. I feel like not mm -hmm. nothing works as well. Mm. Yeah. But maybe it's just because mm. I'm so used to being blonde. But and I think it's totally unfair that you look that good both colors. <laughs> it's not fair. <laughs> It's not fair. Well, she is 19. She's 19, yeah. but she's fabulous yeah. anyway. So a huge thank you to Hilary Duff thank and Barry Duff. We're going to hear Hilary singing at the end of the show. But first, have a quick break. Still to come, he'll be getting down with... What's happening there? Come on, come on, my autocue's not working. He'll be getting down with everybody in the House of Blues. That's the brilliant Brian Harvey. And a little later on, he will be back to perform a new single. I said that first. I shouldn't have. That should have been then. But say thank you. Bye-bye. Back soon.